Hello good people! We have another exciting tutorial for you guys today, as always. And in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to get growl notifications from your Xbox Live notifications. So basically, if someone sends you a message or invites you to a game or a party, or even signs online, or become or you can join their session in progress on Xbox Live, you will get a growl notification on your Mac. You may be asking, well, why is this useful? Well, for me, my uh, TV, my Xbox, really isn't exactly near my iMac, so if I'm sitting in my iMac, I can't see my uh, TV, but I'd like to know if someone, you know, sends me a message or invites me to play a game or whatever. So this application does come in handy. Uh, the application is called Friends, ending in a Z. I'm going to just open that up. It's already sitting in my dock. Um, and while it loads all my stuff, I'm just going to go over the uh, preferences. Uh, so, preferences, your login, put your email and your password, um, then you click sign in. Um, I can show friends in the status bar if I wanted to or not, and you guys can see actually the uh, notifications on the right. Um, here's a box to check if I want growl notifications or not. And then I can choose when I want it to, ref you know, to refresh to see the statuses of my friends and my messages. I have it set to 30 seconds, you guys can have it set to uh, whatever you want. So, um, this is actually has a really nice user interface, and I'm just scrolling down, like, I can see, you know, peop if people are online, I can see what they're playing, I can see what game they're playing, I can see what they're doing in that game, and even for people offline, I can, you know, find out when they were last online, and see what they were doing when they were last online. So, it's a really nice interface, and also, I can, you know, send a message to someone if I wanted to, like, I could click on this guy's name and be like, Hi, you're in my new video and click send and a couple seconds it will send right off um, I can also check my messages if I wanted to so I can just click the messages button scroll down look at all my messages um, I can compose a message if I wanted to I could you know reply if I wanted to and you guys can just see right there you know let me know I have a message I can see that uh, people are joined like during their session in progress um, you also can accept and decline friend requests. Uh, you can also add friend requests. So if I had a friend request, I would show you guys how to accept it, but I don't. Um, but you can also add a friend by going to friends and go to, you know, new friends or whatever and see all that. But also what's really cool is that I can see my achievements. So if I go to friends and then go to achievements, you know, look at the games, Modern Warfare 2, and then, you know, it takes some time to load. But then it will load all of my achievements for this game, and I could do the same thing with Assassin's Creed 2. I'm actually looking forward to Assassin's uh, Creed 3, and as well as, you know, Modern Warfare Black Ops. Um, so right there, yeah, seeing your achievements. This is actually a really useful application. I mean, I really don't use all the features, I just use it to see when people are online or not. But this actually comes in handy, and I actually really like this application, so I'm keeping it in my dock. Um, you know, but that is pretty much it. You know, I, I can see right now that my, you know, Maddox boys are online, so I may go join them and play some uh, play some team deathmatch with them because that's what they're playing right now. Uh, that's actually the clan I'm in. Um, actually, we have a, we have a channel too. We have a YouTube channel. That link will be in the down bar. Um, but that's that's it, guys. That is friends. I hope you guys enjoy this application. I hope you guys down it download it for you Xbox Live players. Um, there may be an app for you PS3 players. I don't know, but um, you know, do a simple Google search. But uh, my name is Matt Fisher. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. And I will see you guys next week. Take care.